Hey guys, now I'm going to do a review on my 2014, I believe. No, 13 actually, sorry. Uh, two, 2013 Airblown Inflatable Ghost with tote bag. Uh, here it is. Before I get into it, um, the fan is actually extremely small for this, and this inflatable is like massive. So I might change the fan now, and the LED is getting ready to go out on it right there. So. And use the adapter. I have one of those phone charger adapters, I like to call them. Like one of the straight ones, but I change them to this because the uh, phone charger ones, they always, uh, they always, like, get hot. So, it takes a little bit to inflate it. That's why I had to inflate it a little bit before the video. Like, this thing's five foot, like, it's massive, as you can see. But, sometimes it inflates fast, sometimes it inflates slow, it all depends. Like, it's not even fully inflated yet. Like that. See? I use this every year, and there's like nothing wrong with it whatsoever. This is like big, as you can see. The first day I got it, I thought it was going to have like a big, big fan on it, but I got this at Home Depot. And for this, some reason, this always uh, doesn't let the arm go up, so I had like to help it up. I might just cut it off right here and throw the tote bag on a different inflatable. Let me uh, open up the tote bag. I'm not, I don't understand why they didn't put like stuffing or something in the uh, tote bag, but here's from afar. Let me turn off the light. You can see it. Yeah, you can, you can barely even see the LED. That's how dim it is. Let me show you the LED. Look, you can like, if, if you're like where I am, uh, it shows in the video and that's really bright, but it's actually extremely, extremely dim. Like on the verge of blowing out. And like this, wait, so come over here for a second. This it does have fading on it, like the back of the hat's faded a little bit. And uh, like it's all, the back of it's all stained, like down there, but here it is one last time. So thank you for watching, liking, subscribing, bye.